Hey there, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be playing Outlast 1. Just recently, Red Barrels has put out a teaser for a new Outlast game called Outlast Trials. And watching that teaser put me in the mood to play some Outlast. This series is one of my most favorite in the horror genre and is such a good survival game. It is honestly so good. And yeah, let's do it. I don't want to put too much strain on myself, so let's just do normal. Outlast contains intense violence, gore, graphic sexual content, and strong language. Please enjoy. You're Miles Upshur, an investigative reporter whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of hell on earth. Always willing to risk digging into the stories no other journalist would dare investigate. You will seek out the dark secret at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can, record everything, you are not a fighter, to navigate the horrors of Mount Massive and expose the truth, your only choices are to run, hide, or die. Let's not die. There it is, Mount Massive. All right, so it's, it's a note from the whistleblower. You can pause if you want to read it. I wonder, are there actual camcorders that small that can also have night vision? I always thought it was like it has to be like a bigger, more expensive camera, not just a camcorder. Or maybe I just don't know cameras. Because I really don't. I mean, the camera on my phone is really good. The quality on it. To raise your camcorder, press right mouse button. Now, I'm no professional at this game. I've just played it multiple times. So I can still die, but at the same time, I sort of know how to avoid it. So this game takes about an hour and a half. That's how long it usually takes me to finish this game. So I'm not sure if I should post this on YouTube as a whole or cut it up in different parts. Or maybe I can do both. I can cut it up different parts and then post that as a whole. Hey there, buddy. And who 
Who are you, then? I... I see. Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. So that was a priest. So the front door is locked because of security. So that means I need to go into the security room and turn off the locks. But the door for the security room is locked, so I need to get its key card, which should be over here. Peeking. When I'm sprinting, same keys, just look backwards. Hey, come on and play. Guess not. Just in case. No, no. Don't do that. No. Restart the generator in the basement. Hide in locker. Don't try to fight. God, he got me. Yeah, a little risky, but I survived. inside and then close the door. A little tip. Once they break down the doors, you have a little window you can go through. Like that. Oh. 
I think that pretty much works everywhere. Also, by no means is it supposed to be a speed run. I just don't want to waste time hiding around for too long. So I'm trying my best to go through some parts as quickly as possible. All right, now that the power's turned back on, I can go back to the kid room. That's kind of hot. But of course, since this is Outlast, it's never that easy. Like, where'd this dude come from? I'm sorry, my son. I didn't want to have to do this to you. But you can't leave. Not yet. There is so much yet for you to witness. Yo, you're so gross. Will you see it? Can you? Our Lord, the Wall Rider, tearing his truth into the unbelievers. The only way out of this place is the truth. Accept the gospel and all doors. That's some paranormal activity shit right there. Record everything. Alright, now we just have to wait for this person to open the door for us. Thank you very much. I'm not really sure why he did that though. Who's this? Maybe Father Martin's men. Maybe. He looks. Y'all want to see some freak shit? Me? I... whatever. How that still works. Hold on, my legs itchy. Let me just scratch it real quick. Ah, there you go. in the corner and be quiet. God, what happened to these people? Okay, once he opens the door, he'll be stuck in the animation until he leaves. 
There we go. So I can just run past him. Battery. I'm quiet, don't worry. Need to chill. I wonder if people like watching like horror let's plays or horror gameplay without the let's player being scared of the game. Like I'm not scared of this game at all, so I'm not really giving any scared reactions. Is it fun watching that? Cuz I noticed that when someone plays a horror game like Outlast, for example, uh they always give like a very like they always like scream as loud as they can at the jump scares and I don't know the stuff like that do people like watching that This must be the most smelliest room because of all these dead bodies. I appreciate that, buddy, but um, I'm trying to leave. <laughs> Oh, you trying to catch me? <laughs> Didn't stand a chance. going you okay
plop. Follow the blood. Wall Rider. Alright, now we're in the sewers. Flush the water by turning the two valves. You ain't gonna get shit, boy. I think he's gonna be around the corner here. There he is. And you just need to run across over here for the second valve. Close the door. And now we wait. Pure quality paint. Mori's? Morves? What's that brand? Morins? I think it's Morins. Is there an I between the R and what looks like an N? God, why do they need all this paint for in the sewers? Morns. So he's probably going to go look for me in the lockers, which gives me the opportunity to run away. I remember this one time I was playing this game on the hardest difficulty, which I think when you die on that, when you die on the hardest difficulty, that just means it's game over, I think. So I died falling down these ladder. Find a way out of the sewers. Huh. 
the priest is just following me. You know, if the priest wanted me to do something, couldn't he just give me a map or the same path he's taking? Because apparently he knows all the shortcuts. Oh, my pinky's getting tired of holding down the sprint button. Is there a way I can toggle the sprint instead of having to hold it down? Toggle crouch. I can't toggle sprint. So there's two paths and I think that one's blocked so we go this way. Just vibing. What was that? All right, so the big guy's with us here. That means I'm just going to go around this whole area instead of going straight to the exit. The exit is over there. You can kind of see it with the light. See that? The ladder? Alright, he sounds kind of close, so I'm just gonna run. Better look next time! Trying to get me. Catch me if you can.
Ew, look at all that blood. You know, I actually like this part. This is like one of my favorite chases in the game because it's pretty long. Okay, gotta run. I just like the music. The chase music in the game is always the best. You hear the song continues? The music? I don't know, maybe it's the specific instrument being used. I'm not. Alright. Haha. Hey, thanks, man. You totally saved my life. Hey, you're that bullshit priest's guy, aren't you? His witness or whatever. You must be exhausted. Let's take a break, huh, buddy? You old two martini lunch? Hmm? Have a little confab, blah, blah. Well, you then you luck. A little car, you wouldn't kill you? Okay, here we go, arms and legs inside the car at all times. <laughs> you know, I love the mountain air up here at night. You, you want to... Head out and then take a stroll. <laughs> Go ahead, I'll wait here. Yeah, can you unstrap Come me? On, run free. <laughs> Just take off the hurry. straps. No? Alright. Those are the grindstone. I like that. Okay yep. then, right. Alright then. You, you could just take off the straps.
You're better not telling any use anyway. Truth be told, I was just tired of licking my own stairs. Here we are, then. Uh, thanks so much for coming by. We'll begin your consultation in a moment. We'll just need a second to wash up and, uh, oh, no movies. And it'll give us a chance to talk. I'm a bit worried how much time you've been spending with Father Martin. I, I Not much. I hope you haven't been letting him confuse you with all this holier-than-thou Bible something. No, don't worry. I'm an atheist. No offense to the man, but I sometimes worry he might just be a little bit crazy. Yeah, probably. It's understandable. Maybe people get scared. There's like to turn to God or something. God died with the gold standard. We're on to a more concrete faith now. You have to rob Paul to pay Peter. There's no other way. Murder in it is the simplest form, but what happens when all money is gone? I'm not all sure. Money becomes a matter of faith. And that's what I'm here for. To make you a uh, doc. Believe. Those are some big scissors. What are you what are you you paying attention? Don't pass that on me. It's so easy to absorb. There. It's better now, right? Here's the way We made the consumer into the means of production. This thing is gonna sell itself. Yeah! <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> there, there. Let it all out, buddy. You know, with all the dead bodies you've been seeing, I'm surprised he has a vomit sooner. Yeah, what the fuck happened to this guy? Gross. What's up? I'm not a patient. I'm an executive, just like him. Like Trigger. Yeah? He got the treatment. He's still alive. Chill to Strenicus Lakers. He worked too well. They couldn't control it. And you can't control it. Nobody. Nobody. Nobody! The Viper! The Kyoku! He's coming now! Trigger! Trigger! Alright, now we just need to get away from the doctor. I don't know if he knows that I'm on this side yet. But the fact that he hasn't called me out...
right. Okay, so we're gonna play a little, little game of ring around the rosy over here. Or maybe I don't have to. Maybe I would just hide in the corner and he'll just walk past me. Like, I know being chased is sort of like the fun part of this game, but uh, sometimes I like to chill and just hide. So we got the keys for the elevator. Which means we can just leave. We're gone. And he's somehow teleported all the way down here. Good job. Now you block the elevator. I'm supposed to turn on the sprinklers to get rid of the fire. I had to burn it. All of it. Murkoff took so much from us. Used us. Turned us into these things because nobody cares about a few forgotten lunatics. So let it burn. There's no water in the system. You must first turn on the two valves.
I know this game isn't that outdated, but it would be nice to see what what a remaster of it would look like. Like LS2 has better graphics, so it'd be cool to see what it would look like on that engine, or it's probably the same engine, but like what would it look like with updated graphics. So scared. Y'all got any batteries? There's one. Parkour. Parkour. And parkour. Okay, dude. Need a hug? He's right there. <laughs> you ain't gonna get me today. Nuh uh, no, sir. So guys, viewer, uh, how was your day? Hopefully it was good. Um, right now it's like 8 a.m. I ate breakfast and had my coffee before playing this game. play ring around the rosy again okay, let's do this oh 
Why is the music overlapping? Sounds kind of weird. Is that, is that like an audio bug or something? Can you hear that? The It was like the music. It plays and it overlaps itself. Is that the right term? Overlapping? I think that's the right term. Hey there, pal. All I need is a fuse, and I'll go away peacefully. And I'll take a battery if you have any. You know, I'm just gonna leave. I don't wanna cause any trouble. Bye. Okay, that is a guy that's trying to kill me. Grab the fuse. Once you grab the fuse, that guy is just gonna be like right in the hallway. He's coded to just go anywhere you are. You make any progress. So I'm just gonna go in this corner here, next to the door, and just wait. Time to go. No. Okay. That was weird. Missing one more. It was from the room he came from. Again, like before, once I grab the fuse, he's gonna know I'm here and he's gonna break down the door.
Go through the door. There you go. Now, Miles, try to grab it. Miles, grab it. No. Thank you. Now we can continue. That key was to unlock the upstairs. Try not to fall down again. Go around it. How rude of you. Okay, you know what? You can stay in here. I think we'll be safe here. Oh crap. No, Cammy. I call my camera Cammy. You need your Cammy to navigate. Find a way to the third floor. Oh, 
Oh, now it's all fucked up. I mean, with a fault like that, I'm surprised that it even still turns on. Hey there. Only one way. This way? All right. How do you know you're not a patient? You know, that's a good question, sir. I should start questioning my sanity. Excuse me. Oh look, that's where you threw me out. Ah, good times. Yes, I'm supposed to tell you the key to the house of God is in the theater. Behind the light. In the theater, behind the light. You have to see the movie, so that's where I left the card. Okay? Thanks for the tip. Behind the theater, you say? There you go. Oh, that's the crazy movie. It makes people crazy. Human 
What kind of things? Can I just hop down? Did that kill me? Alright, I need another key for this elevator. And I think it's through this door. Oh, through here. Get outdoors. Let me shimmy against the wall here. The one is called Mount Massive Asylum. Look at this place. God hates sickness. God hates money. Hey, naked dudes. Am I ready? You are. Yoink. We will join the wall rider in just a moment. My job. You alone shall escape the Talva. This is your penultimate act of witness. The promise of the prophets was always freedom from death. And, and here it is. You will watch and record my death, my resurrection. And together we will be free. You are no longer in any danger. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free. Now, my son. The elevator will take you to the main exit. Well, this is Outlast, so it's never going to be that easy. Okay, so I have to watch out here. The moment I cross this line, I think, uh, the big guy is going to come rushing at me. So, 
Maybe I would just go around this corner and look for a room to hide in. How does he know I'm here? There's no way. There is no way you know that I'm here. Hey, you better leave. Well, okay, I can still go. Alright, now let's get out. Find another way out. Oh, this is where the paranormal activity happened. We're in the end game now, boys. Let's finish this. Anything in here? Just math. I hate math. And that's my cue to go away. F in the chat for the big guy. Speaking of math, I saw this really stupid meme that uh, got the words for math, M-A-T-H, and it said like, mental abuse to humans. I saw that like in middle school and I thought it was funny. I'm his father. He 
certainly loves me, poor idiot. Do you know what this symbol represents? It warns of a nano hazard. Microscopic machines. Technology we have had for decades but never mastered. Kirchhoff discovered in my research a workaround. Turning the cells in the human body into nano factories. It's the natural function of cells to produce molecules, but through psychosomatic direction, we engineer the precise molecules necessary. Mind over body. something so strong. You have to stop him to murder Billy. Turn off his life support, his anesthesia. You have to undo what I've done. No one can get out of this place while he lives. You must kill him. All right, so this is the meme I was talking about. So now our mission is to go kill a ghost. Not sure if that's possible. Mm. Is it really a ghost? Cause its host is kind of alive. It's just like trapped in a bubble. Boom, there's the ghost. It's right on my tail. That ghost should be really fast, so I don't get how I'm able to outrun it. It's kind of like it's letting me go away, but I'm not sure if that's true. Massive door. Here I am, Billy. How are you doing? Hold on, I want to say hi to the guy that's vibing. What's up, Mr. Vibe? really close to the end of the game. It's gonna take like uh, at least six minutes. Six, ten, give or take. Cut off the electric supply from the thingy. Couldn't finish reading it. Hi, Billy. Bye, Billy. a lot of stairs. Whoa. 
I almost fell down. <laughs> he is right there. Objective, disable Billy's life pod failsafe. I can do that. Last chase. Hi, Billy. Bye, Billy. New objective, get out. And I'm not talking about the movie. Get Out's a really good movie. I like it a lot. I haven't seen the movie Us yet. I've been told, or I've heard, that Us is either a really good movie or a really bad movie. And the rest of the people are like in between, like they're confused about it. I don't know, I might give it a watch today. After I'm done with this game. I can just rent it for like a couple bucks maybe. Oh god. Miles is in immense pain. Missing fingers. Bleeding constantly. Broken leg, it looks like. Probably broke some ribs, too. <sighs> hey, guys. You here to help me? That is the exact opposite of help. Alright, so that is Outlast 1. I hope you enjoy watching as much as I enjoyed replaying this game. And uh, it wouldn't hurt if you subscribe, maybe like the video. Mm, if you want to see more gaming content, you could subscribe. You don't have to. It's, it's your option. Whatever. And yeah. See ya.